Hey everyone. A few days ago I posted a video about a relationship rant. Now this rant was based on my own experiences throughout many, many, many years. I spoke about how I'm a giver, always the one working in the relationship and getting a little in return as far as the relationship itself goes, okay? Some people felt that that video meant that I don't love myself. <laughs> Which I think is the most insane thing in the world. Oh, I do love me. Let me tell you what I would have done in the past. And what I have done in the past. A relationship comes to me and I suffer through it. I spend years giving and giving and giving, holding out hope that one day the other person would see what they have and they would be willing and wanting to give back. Unfortunately, in my experiences, that has not happened. So, you know, what is wrong with me putting out there my experiences? Just because I have experienced these things and I continue to want a relationship with someone does not mean that I don't love myself. I love myself plenty. Trust me. Because now I see these patterns much sooner than I ever did before. And I'm standing up, I'm speaking out, and I'm putting a stop to it before I spend too many years in misery. That's healing. That's growth. That's knowing your worth. And I don't do those things anymore. I don't suffer. I may, might spend a day or two, maybe a week or so, suffering. But you know, I'm not one to judge too quickly. I let people show me who they truly are. One incident doesn't necessarily show me. So, I let a little bit more time go by. And if the pattern continues, I'm putting a stop to it. I think that shows that I do love me. That I am healing. And let me tell you what. Healing is a process we will go through for the rest of our lives. We will continue to have things come up in our lives that we need healing for. Always. There's never going to be a moment when we don't need some sort of healing. I just, I just completely want to shut down from the world after reading that post. It's like, what's the point in putting my messages out there if people are going to jump to conclusions and make so many assumptions? But that's the thing. People will always do that. You watch a video or a movie, read a book, read a post based on your own experiences. That's how you interpret those things. And that's, that's the only way you can do it. That's how you relate based on your own experiences. Fifteen people can read the same post and come back and tell you something different about that post. That's just the way it is. Instead of shutting off from the world, I just deleted the post. Because it may have been true for those people, but it's not true for me. I love me. I'm standing up for me, and I'm going to continue to voice my opinion, send out my messages, and continue helping everyone that I can possibly help. Know that you are not alone, and know that you're not the only one who is misunderstood. <laughs> Have a great day, everyone, and remember, Spirit loves you.